From the depths of our planet, a primal force erupts. Volcanoes, these majestic mountains of fire, have captivated humanity for millennia. They are a stark reminder of the raw power that lies beneath our feet. Volcanoes are not just destructive forces, they are creators. They have shaped our continents, our atmosphere, even life itself. Join us now on a journey into the heart of these fiery giants. We will explore their anatomy, their history, and their impact on our planet. Volcanoes are found all over the Earth from the frozen wastelands of Antarctica to the lush tropical islands of the Pacific. They are windows into the Earth's fiery core, offering us glimpses of the forces that have shaped our world for billions of years. In this documentary, we will delve into the science behind these awe-inspiring phenomena, revealing the secrets of their power and majesty. We will travel to the very edge of volcanic craters, feeling the heat on our skin and witnessing the raw energy of eruptions firsthand. Our journey will take us from the fiery heart of Hawaii's Kilauea to the ash-covered slopes of Mount Vesuvius, forever frozen in time. Volcanoes are born from the depths of our planet. Deep within the Earth's mantle, temperatures soar, melting rock into a molten soup called magma. This magma, lighter than the surrounding rock, rises towards the surface. Over time it can pool in vast chambers, building pressure. This pressure seeks release and when it finds a crack or weakness in the Earth's crust, it erupts. These eruptions are the building blocks of volcanoes. Molten rock, ash and gases spew forth, solidifying and accumulating around the vent. Layer upon layer the volcano grows, sometimes slowly over millennia, sometimes rapidly in a matter of days. Each eruption is a unique event, shaping the volcano's form and character. Some volcanoes rise from the ocean floor, their fiery births hidden beneath the waves. Others emerge on land, transforming landscapes and challenging life to adapt. Volcanoes are a testament to the dynamic nature of our planet, a constant reminder that the Earth is always changing. Imagine peering into the fiery heart of a volcano. While a dangerous proposition in reality, science allows us to explore this realm through illustrations and models. Beneath the surface, a network of channels and chambers hold the molten key to a volcano's power. The magma chamber, a vast reservoir of molten rock, fuels the volcano's eruptions. It's a cauldron of intense heat and pressure, a place where solid rock transforms into a liquid state. From this chamber, magma rises through a conduit, a pipe-like structure that acts as a pathway to the surface. The conduit leads to the vent, the opening through which the molten rock and gases escape. The vent is often located at the summit of the volcano, within a bowl-shaped depression called a crater. However, vents can also form on the flanks of a volcano, creating secondary cones and fissures. Magma, the molten rock beneath the Earth's surface, is the lifeblood of a volcano. It is a complex mixture of molten minerals, dissolved gases, and sometimes even crystals. The composition of magma determines its viscosity, its resistance to flow, which in turn influences the type of eruption. Low viscosity magma, often found in Hawaiian volcanoes, tends to flow easily, producing relatively gentle eruptions. These eruptions can create spectacular lava fountains and rivers of molten rock that cascade down the volcano's slopes. High viscosity magma, on the other hand, is thicker and more resistant to flow. This type of magma, found in volcanoes like Mount St. Helens, can trap gases building up tremendous pressure that is often released in explosive eruptions. The gases within magma, including water vapor, carbon dioxide, and sulfur dioxide, play a crucial role in driving eruptions. As magma rises towards the surface, the pressure decreases, causing these gases to expand rapidly, propelling the eruption. Section 5. Gentle Giants and Furious Furies Volcanoes are not all created equal. Some are gentle giants, their eruptions slow and effusive, while others are furious furies, capable of unleashing unimaginable power. The type of eruption depends on a complex interplay of factors, including the composition of the magma, the amount of dissolved gases, and the structure of the volcano itself. Hawaiian eruptions, named after the iconic volcanoes of Hawaii, are characterized by their relatively gentle nature. Low viscosity magma allows gases to escape easily, resulting in effusive eruptions with flowing lava fountains and rivers. Strombolian eruptions, named after the Italian volcano Stromboli, are more energetic, with short bursts of explosions that eject glowing lava fragments into the air. 
Vulcanian and Plinian eruptions on the other hand, are highly explosive. Thick, viscous magma traps gases, leading to a buildup of pressure that is released in violent explosions. These eruptions can send massive columns of ash and gas high into the atmosphere, blanketing the surrounding landscape in ash and potentially impacting global climate. Section 6. When Mountains Explode, Historic Eruptions Throughout history, volcanic eruptions have captured our imaginations and left an indelible mark on our planet. From the ancient cities buried by Vesuvius to the recent devastation of Mount St. Helens, these events serve as stark reminders of the awesome power of nature. In 79 AD, Mount Vesuvius erupted, burying the Roman cities of Pompeii and Herculaneum under a thick layer of ash and pumice. This catastrophic event preserved these cities in time, offering us a unique glimpse into Roman life. Centuries later, the 1883 eruption of Krakatoa in Indonesia, unleashed a series of tsunamis that killed tens of thousands of people. The eruption also injected massive amounts of ash and gas into the atmosphere causing global temperatures to drop. In 1980, Mount St. Helens in the United States erupted, dramatically altering the surrounding landscape. This eruption, the deadliest and most economically destructive volcanic event in U.S. history, served as a stark reminder of the importance of monitoring and understanding volcanic activity. Section 7 Sentinels of the Earth The Global Volcanism Program Around the world, scientists dedicate their lives to studying volcanoes, seeking to understand their behavior and mitigate their potential impact on human populations. The Global Volcanism Program, a collaborative effort between the Smithsonian Institution and the United States Geological Survey, plays a vital role in this endeavor. The GVP monitors volcanoes worldwide, collecting and analyzing data on eruptions, seismic activity, and gas emissions. They maintain a database of over 1,500 active volcanoes, providing valuable information to researchers, emergency management agencies, and the general public. By studying past eruptions and monitoring current volcanic activity, scientists hope to improve our ability to predict future events and minimize their impact. This work involves deploying sophisticated instruments on the slopes of volcanoes, analyzing satellite imagery, and conducting fieldwork in some of the most extreme environments on Earth. The knowledge gained from these efforts is crucial for safeguarding communities living in the shadow of these fiery giants. Section 8. Shaping Our World – Volcanoes and Climate Volcanoes are not just isolated phenomena, they are interconnected with Earth's climate system in profound ways. While individual eruptions can have localized and even regional impacts, large-scale eruptions can influence global climate patterns for years or even decades. Volcanic eruptions release massive amounts of gases and ash into the atmosphere. Some of these gases, such as sulfur dioxide, can react with water vapor to form aerosols, tiny particles that reflect sunlight back into space. This can lead to a cooling effect on Earth's surface. The 1991 eruption of Mount Pinatubo in the Philippines, for example, caused a temporary decrease in global temperatures. Volcanoes also release carbon dioxide, a greenhouse gas that contributes to global warming. However, the amount of carbon dioxide released by volcanoes is dwarfed by human activities such as the burning of fossil fuels. Understanding the complex interplay between volcanoes and climate is crucial for predicting future climate change and developing effective mitigation strategies. Section 9. A Legacy of Fire a future of awe. Volcanoes with their fiery breath and awe-inspiring power have shaped our planet and captivated our imaginations for millennia. They are a testament to the dynamic forces that continue to shape our world, a constant reminder that we live on a planet that is constantly evolving. As we have journeyed into the heart of these fiery giants, we have explored their anatomy, their history, and their impact on our planet. We have witnessed their destructive potential and their creative power, their ability to both threaten and sustain life. Volcanoes are a powerful reminder of our place in the grand scheme of things. They teach us humility in the face of nature's awesome power, and they inspire us to learn more about the world around us. As we move forward, it is essential that we continue to study and monitor these fiery giants respecting their power while marveling at their majesty. For volcanoes are not just geological wonders, they are an integral part of our planet's story, a story that continues to unfold with each eruption.